I welcome all of you and uh, this particular video is related to the form filling of IUCL. So uh, as you know IUCL has released the list of uh, all of you Jinko calls I hain for interview GD and GT and uh, Europedia is the dedicated only platform where you can prepare for all of these. So this particular video I will be discussing about the form which IUCL given you and you have to fill that form. Kuch uh, entries I see hain which I want to uh, discuss with you which are more important entries. As you see uh, your marital status, your religion, uh, whether you belong to community, minority community, state domicile, mother tongue, these all are simple things. I am very sure you can answer these. There is nothing uh, required in this. Ye aapka apna, uh, you know, family uh, uh, sara information hai. Aapko uske bar mein detail mein bharna hai. Your parents, your spouse, if you are married, your kids, something like that is written. And uh, next uh, uh, slide is related to your address. So address also I have nothing to uh, tell you in your address. Wo aapko pata hai aapka address aapko kya bharna hai. Uh, even if, if you have any doubt, aap ye question shoot kar sakte hai is video ke upar and uh, uh, our team will be replying you on this particular video. Then comes qualification. Yes, 10th, uh, 12th, all these qualifications are, uh, you know, it can be discussed, these qualifications can be there. And then comes, you know, diploma and uh, this, uh, uh, if you have done kind of diploma, if you have not done any diploma, then you will not fill any kind of uh, thing here, you will fill NA there. Then comes engineering degree, so BTEC or whatever you have done. So engineering degree is there and uh, after that engineering ka course they have mentioned, uh, name of engineering college, so name of the university, those things are mentioned here. So it is related to uh, those uh, particular uh, details. Then engineering examination system, uh, duration of the course, if you open the system, you will know what are the domains. It is very simple for you to fill. Duration of the course, how many years of engineering you have to fill. If you are in the final year, when will the result come? When will you have admission? When will you have passing year? All of these things will come here. Marking system, maybe CGP or percentage, you have to write here. Uh, semester wise, you have to fill your details. Bharne hai, details of marks, code in engineering. And semester wise, year wise, it will come from you. Intro ke andar unke paas ye document rahega. They will be having this document in the interview. So if there is any discrepancy in your marks, let's say first year, second year, your marks are very less, then that becomes a probable question in the interview. They can ask you that. Aggregate percentage as as per the mark sheet that also you have to write. And then comes uh, whether you are doing your PG or not. Now in this particular part, ye teen entries aisi hain where I can uh, tell you and. Uh, these are very very important and uh, maximum students have confusion here and they will not make very good uh, you know judgment in that. So uh, are you currently doing your post graduation? You should fill it. Many students say sir should we reveal that we are doing M.Tech? Why not? You should reveal it. Sir if I have told M.Tech, then you will ask M.Tech a question from M.Tech. Oh, this is the question for asking. If you don't ask M.Tech, then you will ask someone else. So you want to go to the interview and you don't talk to anyone. Nobody should ask you any question. So don't worry about what you will ask them. So don't worry about you should only provide your information. Last year also there were hundreds of students got selected who were doing M.Tech. Kya kya question puchega that we will discuss with you. So yes, if you are doing M.Tech, you should fill that particular thing here that you are doing M.Tech. Yes. Now what project you have done you during industrial training or on the job or any kind of project. So aapko project ke baare mein likhna hai. What was the title of the project? From where you got the idea to do that project? What was your contribution in that project? What was new in that project? Where was engineering involved in that project? Experimentation, simulation, what did you do analysis, optimization, what did you use software you used in that project? And what was the conclusion of that project? And how it is going to be valuable for industry? These are the things you have to basically mention here very meticulously. After you discuss this one time, if you want, you can share it with me, show it to me on the Zoom and I will tell you how correctly you are to make it up and after that, we will upload it. So, you can discuss that particular thing with me. Now, what are the entries? Yes, there are many entries. Now, what are the entries? 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 What are if uh, through this particular column because that is something where he has given you independence to tell anything about you area of interest means academic interest it can be academic interest and or it can be personal interest 
it can be academic interest that sir i am very much interested in automobiles anything you want to say or sir i am very much interested in trekking or something like that so areas academic areas of academic interest areas of personal interest area of professional interest area of personal interest it can be anything तो आप उसको लिख सकते हो एंड 500 सौ करेक्टर हैं तो आप उसके ऊपर डेल्व कर सकते हो इन डिटेल यू कैन ऑल्सो मैंशन एंड दिस विल हेल्प यू टू बेसिकली पुल इंटरव्यू इन पर्टिकुलर डायरेक्शन एंड लेट मी टेल यू वन मोर थिंग 500 सौ वर्ड्स का जो करेक्टर है नॉट वर्ड्स इट इज अ करेक्टर करेक्टर इज ए बी सी वो करेक्टर होता है वर्ड नहीं है वो सो पांच सौ करेक्टर की अगर लिमिट दी है वो मैक्सिम है तो मैं उससे पहले उसको खत्म करना है उसके बाद ऑब्वियसली वर्क एक्सपीरियंस अगर है तो उसको मैंशन करोगे And uh, you will tell that uh, आपने इंटरव्यू आई यू सी एल का पहले दिया है कि नहीं दिया है अगर दिया है तो मैंशन करना है एम टेक कर रहे हो तो मैंशन करना है झूठ मत बोलो उसमें बता दो दिया है तो उसको मैंशन करना है uh, कोई आपका रिलेटिव अगर आई यू सी एल में जॉब कर रहा है तो आपको उसके बारे में बताना है और अगर कोई आपका रिलेटिव डायरेक्टर है आई यू सी एल का उसके बारे में बताना है कीप टेलिंग ऑनेस्टली वट एवर इज बींग आस टू यू सो डू यू एग्री टू बींग पोस्टेड एनी वेयर ऑब्वियसली कहीं पे भी आपको भेजा जाएगा अब्रॉड भेजा जाएगा आई एम रेडी फॉर दैट सेलेक्ट द लैंग्वेज फॉर जी डी जी टी पर्सनल इंटरव्यू बोथ हिंदी एज वेल एज इंग्लिश सो सपोज यू कैन ओनली स्पीक हिंदी देन यू कैन मैंशन दैट हिंदी इफ यू कैन ओनली स्पीक इंग्लिश यू कैन मैंशन दैट इंग्लिश इफ यू कैन स्पीक बोथ सर कैन आई स्पीक बोथ इन ग्रुप डिस्कशन ग्रुप टास्क आंसर इज यस यू कैन स्पीक बोथ In fact, fluency जो है बोथ में बनी होती है बिकॉज देर आर सर्टन थिंग्स विच यू वॉन्ट टू स्पीक इन इंग्लिश लाइक इंट्रोडक्शन एंड देर आर सर्टन थिंग्स विच यू वॉन्ट टू स्पीक इन हिंदी लेटर ऑन अगर उन्होंने कोई क्वेश्चन पूछ लिया कि बताओ यार मेरिट में क्या फेमस है तो मे बी यू वुड लाइक टू आंसर दैट इन हिंदी बिकॉज ऑफ यर फ्लुएंसी सो यू कैन पुट बोथ हेयर तो कब इंग्लिश पुट करना है इफ यू आर यू नो इफ यू डू नॉट नो हिंदी देन इंग्लिश वेन यू हैव टू पुट हिंदी इफ यू डू नॉट नो इंग्लिश and when you have to put both if you know both the languages and you can speak in both so obviously you are not prosecuted uh, wo aap likhoge and uh, uh, in event of selection do you have any mobility constraint obviously no you don't have any mobility constraints so let me tell you in this entire form there are couple of places where i would like to advise that if you are doing masters or something you must say yes whether it is first semester second semester does not matter you should mention that and you should mention very clearly that whether you are doing job or not or currently what are you doing and these two are the you know uh, blocks which you should take maximum time to fill acche tarike se isko bharo ek bar isko roughly bharne ke baad uh, fix up zoom session with me and mere ko usko batao kis tarike se aapne bhara hai i'll send you whatsapp uh, audio recording and then you can make the changes ye bahut important document hai entire interview will be pulled in that particular direction so all the very best and let's start preparing for this thank you